Mickey Adimundi has finally made it to Black Series. It's been over a year since he was like, what, pipeline and then announced and wasn't put up for pre-order and showed up for pre-order very recently. And I missed like when it sh when it popped up and I couldn't get it. I had to, I think I ordered, ended up ordering this through Big Bad Toy Store. So I'd pay a little bit extra, but I finally have him. I was afraid I would miss him entirely. And of course, now he's shown up in the Acolyte. Only he's you know, not not quite as white in the beard and the eye, eyebrows. Um, so we have Candy Mooney. This is number four. And what, the Revenge of the Sith? Is that really? No, Attack of the Clones. Okay. Just say, we haven't gotten really Revenge of the Sith yet, right? But we finally got him. His lightsaber almost looks red there. Kind of interesting. Um, especially when you consider that first uh, Hasbro figure back in 99, he had a purple lightsaber. So let's take a look at Kiati. So here we have Kiati, and he's got a lot different for him, right? Number one, oh wow, look at that. He's, he's actually got a painted uh, thread around his little top knot there. Nice details on the head. Good old cone head here, right? Um, but his body is different from a lot of the other Jedi, which means you can't use the same Jedi outfit. He's got a different style of robe. He's still got his belt here and all that, but th this robe is very different. You see he's got his hood there. Um, it's kind of like a cloak robe, but it's half. Like, it doesn't go down near as far as a Jedi's robe. He looks a little bit different. His boots are a little bit different, right? And then a little more, almost like swashbuckler boots there. Um, so he's got a lot of different things going for him, which makes him not necessarily easy for Hasbro to just, you know, use the Jedi body and pop a new head on, that type of thing. That is a good head. They did a nice job with Kiati Mundi. Makes you wonder if they'll reuse some of this and do an Acolyte version or not. And, you know, I know there's people who feel all sorts of ways about the Acolyte. I'm not going to get into that here. I'm going to say I've enjoyed the show, but um, it does have his lightsaber right here. No extra paint on there. It's just a silver hilt with the blue blade. Uh, let's see how he holds it. Make sure he holds it well. There we go. Yeah. Holds his lightsaber pretty well. I think he can hold it with both hands if he wants. Kind of. Oh, he's got like little almost gauntlets on his gloves there. Well, not gloves, but on his hands, I should say. See if we can get that on there. There we go. Yeah, he can hold his lightsaber with both hands. I can't say he can do a whole lot, but he can do it. There. He can uh, give you a Jedi salute. There we go. Look at that. All right. So uh, he can hold it with both hands. So notice that um, you can pop that off and put the lightsaber on his belt. He actually has the the lightsaber spot on the belt here. Let's get that on there. It doesn't quite want to go in there. It's a little crooked. There we go. So you can have his lightsaber hanging on his belt, which is pretty cool. I guess you probably a little bit more like that and look a little bit better. But... Uh, so he's got that capability. We haven't had all of our Jedi like that. All in all, a really nice figure. Good to get Kiati Mundi finally. Good figure for the year. Um, he does have like the cuts in his trousers and that. You can see it's made so that when you when you have it straight up, and then you could kind of see a little bit more of that. But I mean, it works. And the same thing in his arms. He's got kind of poofy sleeves and. When you when you move it, they've done a good job to, to try and keep it so it, it retains a good shape in that and gives you lots of movement. I mean, look how far up he can bring his arm like that. That's pretty good. Um, it's not as far more than 90 degrees, isn't it? But it's, uh, you know, a little bit limiting just by how, making sure the shape all works on that. But has really a nice job on those cuts and everything. So there we go. Yaddy Moody.